Welcome to Extreme Web Designs. My name is Rocky and in this video I am going to show you how to install fonts in Windows 10. So let's get started. So in order to install the fonts, make sure that you have downloaded the font from a website of your choice or that you have arranged for it. Typically a font would have the file extension TTF or OTF. TTF means true type font and OTF means open type font. You could install any of these fonts as long as you have downloaded them on your computer. So there are two ways to install the fonts. The first way is to right click a font of your choice and then click on the install option. Or you can simply double click on a font and that will launch the installer itself. So I'm going to show you the easiest way which is the double clicking method. And notice that the font name is rubik-black. So let's double click that. And, and it's going to open up a pop-up like this and you will have two options, the first one being print and the second one being install. Click the install button and it says installing Rubik Black and now it has installed. So let's verify if the Rubik Black font has been installed in our system or not. So open up Microsoft document or any other text editor of your choice wherein it gives you an option to change the font and let's go ahead and type the word test and then let's type Rubik. As you can see the Rubik black font name has been populated. Simply hit the enter key and as you can see the Rubik black font has been applied. So let me just increase the font size so that it's clear. Now let's try to install the Rubik italic font. In the second way simply right click on that and click on the install option and it says installing Rubik Italic and it has installed the font and I'm going to change this to Rubik Italic so let's type in the words here Rubik Italic as you can see although I have typed the words it is not showing up the words Italic so I'm going to say Rubik hyphen Italic Still, it's not populating for me. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to remove the words italic and any special characters here. And I'm going to click on this drop down arrow here. And as you can see here, I do see the Rubik word in italic. So if I click on this, you will notice that even though it has not applied or changed the name to Rubik italic, it is changing the font style to italic. If you do not see any specific font style, do not worry. Just simply type in the name of the font and then click on this drop down arrow and it will show you all the available options for that font. So if you still don't see it, you can simply look for the font name and you can just manually search because all the font names are visible here in ascending order. So because it starts with R, you can scroll down till you find all the fonts starting with the letter R. And as you can see here, it is Rubik in italic and Rubik in black. So that is how easy it is to install the fonts in Windows 10. Thanks for watching. If this video was helpful, please show your support by leaving a like, comment, and share the video on social media. Subscribe to the channel and tap the bell icon to receive all future updates. Thanks for watching.